welcome back to Harvest with Jose, everybody. How are we doing tonight? I hope we are doing good. Ooh, hey, there he is. <laughs> I was waiting on you. <laughs> right on time. Dominic Zen, what's up, my dude? Welcome, bro. Ultrabot09, hey, how are we doing? AG Lag, welcome aboard, dude. Good to have you here. Draconicus Rex, what's up, my dude? Been a minute. Good to see you here, bro. Another Prey live stream. Hell yeah. We're ready for part three. Are we good to go? Are we good to go? Welcome, Slayer. Welcome, Slayer. You caused this mess. I'm, I'm glad you're here. I'm glad you're here. Uh, Gary the Neutral. What's up, dude? Uh, let's see. Uh, praying with Jose. I like that. I like that. I'm going to steal it. <laughs> here we go. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, you're still watching Nectar. Yeah, everybody. If you're if you wanna if you wanna multitask, we were just watching uh, Nectar Mechanics, B from Nectar Mechanics, uh, doing a live stream interview right now, over on a YouTube channel called I think it's the Sons of. Let me let me double check. Let me double check. Does anybody have that name? I don't have the I don't have the tab up anymore. But I put the link over on the on on the Discord, over on the uh, self promo slot. I want to give them a bit of a boost if I could. Children of Primus, thank you, Dom. It is doing great. I, I did not figure. I think their interviews, I think their live streams go for like for like three hours. So I'm like, oh, this is not going to end anytime soon. I got to dip out, you know. <laughs> I wish I could stay for the whole thing, though. But he's doing fantastic. I'm so proud of that dude. I'm so proud of him. Um, I'll probably go back and, and check the rest of it later after the stream today. But if anybody wants to, feel free to drop in, show your love, give him a thumbs up, and, uh, and give him your support. I do love it. I do love it. Uh, let's see, doing okay. So watching Nectar. Um, was well, so worried you weren't streaming, because I was like, oh no, did I did I get up ninety eight for nothing? No, 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 dude. No, 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 no. Just, just I was literally I think about two minutes late. We're we're, we're good. We're good. <laughs> it's either like I'm an hour early or I'm two minutes late. You know, there is no in between. <laughs> there were there was a time I think when I barely started streaming on Twitch, even on YouTube, where I would literally be sitting here like like uh, like watching the time. And I'd be like, okay, okay, and go live. And then they'll be like, okay, it's on the minute. I don't really, I don't really, should I, should I be punctual? Would you all prefer that I, that I be punctual? The, the thing about that though, is that sometimes, sometimes if I'm ready, like early, like say like an hour early, I'd love to jump on an hour early, you know? Um, but I think, I know that, that for this particular game though, it's a little bit special because because, yeah, uh, Slayer, you used 50,000 points to get us here. And and so that I, I, that's why I did also DM you yesterday. Hey, buddy, I hope I hope I'm not waking you, but I hope I also am. You know, we're about to jump on. You know, otherwise, you'll just catch me when you catch me and whatnot. Um, I think for the most part, though, we'll be pretty punctual. Oh, I will say this. I will say this. I think for next weekend, next weekend is I'm my siblings and I, I'm going to be helping out my my folks um, uh, next weekend, which I'm still going to stream. I'm still going to stream, but because I'm doing, um, the YouTube, uh, spray painting on the weekend, I don't know if that's going to be on Saturday or on Sunday. I think it may end up having to be on, um, on, on, on Sunday morning. I'm not entirely sure yet because I have to see what kind of a schedule my parents are going to have. Um, my siblings and I take turns on helping them out, you know, to run errands and, and chores and whatnot, um, on the weekends. And so this week, next, next weekend is going to be my turn. So it, I think I'm most in the daytime is it's probably going to be when I'm going to be like busy and whatnot. There's a chance, there's a chance, Slayer, I want to let you know, uh, we may jump on a stream for Prey on Friday night. Um, cause we're not doing, we're not doing the pixel streams anymore right now. Not for right now. I think we might jump on Prey Friday night. So keep an eye out for that. Keep an eye out for that. Uh, you unfortunately didn't wake me. That's good. That's good. Had no notifications, uh, turned way down when I said, oh, that's good, dude. That's good. I'm glad to hear it, but again, I'm sorry that you lost a little bit. You weren't actually that late, though. I think you were like 15, 20 minutes late. It wasn't too bad, though, right? It wasn't too bad. Um, Today, though, <clears throat> like I mentioned, we're going to jump into some more Prey. We have part three. I think um, I think Slay, you can agree with me that it's... I'm well, what, what you're probably noticing, Slay, is that for me, I'm, a, I'm an explorer. I like to explore every nook and cranny of um, an explorable environment. So... It's probably taking me a bit longer to do stuff that they maybe that you did yourself in your playthrough, which I'm okay with that. Um, I don't know how much we're going to progress today. We have another marker, I think, on the map coming up. Friday night, so basically Saturday, 
morning for me. Yes. Yes. I think the next time we do a pixel stream, I wanna I do wanna actually draw some more emotes. So that one might be like in a couple of weeks. And then after we do that, then I think we're gonna actually jump into um doing Pixel Megatron 2.0. There was a background that I was working on with that had the, the, the pixelized arc. I still want to get that completed because I'm going to use that on the channel, I think, when I am when I eventually start running ads. Um, plus, I was going to let um, Nectar Mechanic use it for one of his videos as well. So, I do, I do kind of want to get that done in a timely fashion. Maybe we'll continue to work on that one as well. So, we'll see. We'll see. I wish so much a stream of where it's night for me. Oh, it's easier for me to be uh, to be tenfold? To be tenfold? You know, you know, the problem with streaming is that when I used to not stream and um, almost any game I play, I would have all the lights out that would help you to like get get into like the mood and the focus of the game. Obviously, when you're streaming, you have to have lights on me unless I was to ever stream without a camera. But why would I deny you guys seeing this luscious face though, right? So sadly, I have I have a light on. I used to have a spotlight on me on the other side, but not, not so much anymore though. But that's okay. I think we still get in the mood for these uh, spoopy games, right? Right? Didn't really do a whole lot today, though. I did actually, um, I went through and cleaned up a lot of details on my channel. Like, um, now that I have the Patreon up and running, um, I went ahead. There's like that intro screen that you see that has all of the, uh, the symbols for all the social medias down below. I went ahead and redid that to add the logo for the Patreon. I think I added the TikTok logo, too. Also, at the end of all of my videos on the YouTube side that you see, thanks for watching, and you see all of the uh, the logos down below as well. I added the Patreon to the other one. And when I'm talking about them at the end of the videos, it's like a lot of like stuff that I have to like, organize and keep up to date. Um, not only that, but I, there used to be a picture of a literally a blue sky that was, I guess, like, like the logo for the social media of, of Blue Sky. They updated their logo to a butterfly, a more simplified logo that I think it looks better. So then I updated that as well. Just a lot of cleanup, a lot of cleanup. Um, and whenever I start doing that, though, it usually does take up a, a good chunk of the day, which it did today. But I'm glad I got that updated because looking at outdated stuff, it, it does kind of it does kind of irk me. Like that shouldn't be like that. That shouldn't be like that. You know. But we're good though. Um, once again, the weekend is about to be over. It always feels like it goes by way too fast. Is my is my uh, green screen too high? Just one. Okay, perfect. We're going to jump into some prey as we bid adieu to Sunday. I don't know if I'm going to go over three hours today, though. I think I think we're going to keep it at a tight three hours because um, tomorrow morning I do plan to get up extra early to go do some laundry. Womp womp. I must. And I usually get up around two to two and a half hours earlier than I normally do. So it's going to be like around 4.30 to 5. So um, I've got to hit the bed <laughs> Pretty soon here. Disability payment increased by 20. Oh, nice, dude. Thank you, government. Wow, government's doing something good for you. Nice. Nice. I know, yeah. We're starting the horror early. God. Sometimes getting up early to do the laundry is just a pain. I could easily go on weekends. The reason I don't go on weekends at a normal time is because if I do, when I go to the laundromat, there's a ton of people there, like a ton of people there. And it takes you that much longer to, to, to do your laundry. I like going super early where I work. Um, in, in the shopping center that I work in, in my office, my, not my office, but the office that I work at, there's also a laundromat in that same shopping center. So I'll go, it's like, I'm going to work extra early. There is literally nobody there at the laundromat, or maybe there's like one or two people and I can do it in peace. And then I, and then I literally drive like uh, two stores down park and then I'm, and I'm at work. So it's super convenient. It's just the fact that you have to get up super early to do so, but I'll have like my headphones on. I'll be listening to some podcasts. I'll have my I'll have my coffee and donut ready, you know. Um, but I have to go to bed at a regular time. Otherwise, I skip <laughs> the laundry bath and leave it for the next day. So, anywho, anywho, laundry scarier than prey because uh, socks magically disappear. Yeah, you, you're not right. You, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. I think one of the socks transforms into the little goo guys and like scurries away. Right? Don't you hate it when that happens? Uh, no beer tonight. This is some um, iced tea. Lemon flavor. Love it. 
love it, love it, love it. Uh, if you want some amazing materials drag, every pickable item in the lobby, and pray, throw a recycle, oh, throw a recycler charge. Um, all that turns into materials. Oh, that's cool. You know, I was surprised how yesterday, how well that little technique worked with the, um, with the, uh, recycler charge towards the two corrupted droids when we were, like, up on the ceiling and whatnot. That works so good, man. So good. Uh, do you prefer iced tea or soda? Definitely iced tea, AG. Definitely iced tea. Soda's great. Soda's wonderful. I don't have, I'm not anti-soda, but I am, I am trying to cut back on soda, though. Um, I'm trying to cut back on sugar in general, although iced tea, I think iced tea might have like as much um, sugar in it. But when I make it myself, I do make it with a little bit less sugar. I actually like to mix um, powdered iced tea with powdered lemonade to make Arnold Palmer lemon flavored iced tea. It's the best. I love it, especially when it gets hotter weather. It's good. But other than that, I love water. I love water. Maybe you can't tell because I'm usually drinking coffee or um, some alcoholic beverages on stream, but I, I love water. I love water. Yeah, water's great. <laughs> uh, little grenades are finite, so use them sparingly. Yes, I think I think that's like the only one that I've used so far. Um, yeah, I definitely all the all those stuff that I have, like as far as like ammunition and whatnot. Yeah, I'm gonna be very frugal about it. You know, as little bit as I can. Maybe the one item is the glue gun. I feel like I have so many, um, so much glue ammo, 400 and something. I think that's probably okay, especially when you're considering you, that's to make like um, those makeshift uh, ladders or stairs to get up to like second floors and whatnot. So it'll, it'll come in handy for that. That's it over here. Uh, here we go. All right. Jump on in here. Once again, left the game in suspended mode. Right where we left off, we had just gotten to the doctor's station here. Oh, I can't wait to deal with those dudes. Can't wait to deal with them. What are they? Who knows? Who knows? I guess it's more of those um, Venom symbiotes, but they're on fire for some reason. Great. Great. Fantastic. Annoying, yeah, I can already tell. I can already tell. Let me take a look at the map here real quick. Get ourselves uh, situated. Um, yeah, we have the marker heading back out to the lobby. Uh, there's still parts of the foyer that we haven't really been to. I don't know why. Was that blocked off? Let me try to hit that place up real quick. They come from a more knowing boss. Okay. Yeah, let me take the elevator. Again, I'm not going to be assuming that there are no... No dudes around here. Because it looks like they respawn. Pretty sure there was another phantom here. No? I think there was one when I went back in to save... Yeah, I just can't, I just can't feel safe. Can't feel safe. Um, since you ex explore most of the map already, we can go straight to the video. After to watch the video, you can go to the new area called Psychotronics, really? Okay. Oh, so we're just going to go rewatch the rest of the video then. I still want to check the top of this section, top of the foyer. And Director Thorstein, Thorstein's office, as we haven't seen that. But again... Welcome. I'm, Maybe I can help you. I'm not taking for granted that there's nothing here. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. Alright, let's... let's head on up. Are you fucking kidding me?! Oh no. He followed me down here. Oh, we're doing in health. 65. 
said, surprise, motherfucker! Jesus. And now he's down here. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Is he actually coming down here? Uh, is he coming all the way over here? <laughs> he's coming over here! Ah! Ah! <laughs> well. Well. See, that's not cool. That's not cool. You know what? Let's let's go ahead and reload here. Don't like that. Wasn't our health all the way at at max? Yeah, it was. So that dude's right on top. Man, he wasted. He wasted no time. Oh, is he already spotting me? He can spot me from the top. Got it. Got it, got it, got it. I would take him out. Especially now that we have the, uh, the little droids that can fix us up. get you wait what happened to him what oh, happened to him good to see you again, Dr. You. fucking game fucking game stop doing that no way did that kill him what is this a Typhon lure I don't, I don't get this game sometimes. I don't get this game. The glue gun could not have killed him. Typhon Lore, a.k.a. Nightlight, emits a psycholuminescent signal that emits Typhon uh, to move toward the lure for a short period of time, combined with other weapons or tactics to escape, ambush, or observe Typhon for a, from a safe distance. Um, it can be thrown or affixed to a stationary object using R2. Okay. Psychotronics is such a cool ass hell area. Noted. Noted. These are useful. Okay. You better give Nectar a big thank you. He just shouted out the door. Oh, nice. Nice. Hell yeah. I definitely will. Very nice. Ba, 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 ba. Okay. I don't want to use this right now. What the fuck? How far is this lightning? No. No. God, do we have to take the thing out again? Yep, we do. No? Yes, it is. It's right here. Okay. I am curious. Oh, you know what happened? The electricity got him. That's not going to reach me. I think the electricity got him. Hey, now. What a terrible shot this is, man. Vital signs. No. No, no, no. Try that again. Yeah, let's just try that again, shall we? <laughs> let's just uh, try that again, shall we? I do want to get him to the uh, corner that's right there, though. That's weird. That's super weird. Come on, dude. Come on. Come on. Come on. What am I even 
I'm throwing. What am I? <laughs> no, no. No, 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 no. Man, we got so lucky. We got so lucky the first time. Let's try that again, shall we? Why did I switch over to... I just think because in the chaos, I'm just hitting any button. That is, that is fucking bullshit, dude. That is fucking bullshit. Are you fucking kidding me? Hello, are you here for an appointment? No, fuck this shit, man. Hello, good to see you again, Dr. Yu. Yes, yes, yes. Diagnosing superficial injuries. Nothing a portable medical kit can handle. This won't take long. The glue, the glue wasn't sticking to him. Please fill out a patient experience questionnaire so I can serve you better next time. All right, we're not doing so bad on the suit. save oh that's right this one didn't I guess it's kind of randomized huh I'm sure we'll get it soon enough okay so again how come I get in There's another one in here. How come I didn't go in here before? I think I just kind of missed it. Where is he? Take that. Cooking with cauliflower. Renowned for its versatility and lush aroma, cauliflower can be substituted in many traditional recipes to boost their nutrient payload without compromising any flavor. Faux mashed potatoes, pizza crust, cauli, uh, fried rice, pellet, and more. But if you're looking to maximize the health benefits of this dimple delicacy, then steaming is your best bet. Go for the purple variety if you really want to add a blast of color to your plate. Okay, cool. Tattoo gig, what up, bro? How you doing, man? Thanks for joining the, uh, the stream for uh, Nectar Mechanics, dude. Good to have you there. Nice to have your support there. Don't need any of that. We have we had some stuff in here. There it is. 
did some spray tests and the paints I got are beautiful. Nice. Which ones are they again? What brand are they? What is this? Oh, I'm out of room. Oh, I'm out of room. What? Recycler, yeah, yeah, yeah. We don't need another cannon. We don't have any room for it. We'll take that. No room for that. Our health is full. I don't want to. I don't want to waste a suit item. If I don't. Have to. Where's that other phantom at? Oh, there he is. There he is. I see you, little fucker. No entry. Literally there's no entry. They can enter right here. I don't need that. The game makes them sound so close though. God, I wish I could fix him. I wish I could fix him. Um how far away are we from that? I need four, I have two. To break falls, right. Got it, got it, got it. Okay. Oh, you know what? I still want to explore the other side. That phantom is on the ground level, so I should be okay. Heading over to the other side, right? Oh, wait, maybe I can't. Ah, we got it, we got it, we got it. Kill me, mug. Don't kill me. Hey, yep, yep. Oh shit. Okay, that's the office. Uh, I'm gonna let you give you tips because I don't know anything about this game. Hello, good call. Thank you, AG. Big of you, big of you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Shit. Alright, let's save. Let's save. Man, I do wish I had better weapons. Firepower 8 seems super low. so many pistols. <sighs> okay. We don't have these assigned. Five. 
I don't think they're gonna do much. Maybe just start with a glue gun. Terrible, dude. That was fucking terrible. Did I take any damage off of him? I keep forgetting the buttons here. Jorgen Thorstein's cabin. <laughs> oh, oh, is he starting to spot me? Yes, he is. Great. Get that everybody go have have some dinner. Hey, thanks for coming us. Hope you have a good one, dude. Catch you in the next one, bro. The cabin is so far away. The cabin. Okay. Throw the banana peel. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think it's that kind of game. <laughs> Sadly. Sadly. Well, let's check this out now. <sighs> the fuck was that? The fuck was that? Space elevator. My new employer, Dr. Thorstein, I just want to write um, you personally and thank you for the new employer. I know some people have been on a waiting list to get one of these, and it was a pleasant surprise to find a new one in my office this morning. It is this feeling of gratitude that makes it awkward for me to trouble you further. However, if you could spare one of your engineers for a bit, it would be great if they could swing by and show me exactly what it does. Thanks, Dr. Deo Igwe. Okay. Port requisition. Wanted to clear a Morgan request again. Morgan was done in hardware today, just standing there as if not sure where to go. And when I offered to help, Morgan asked for more operator parts. I asked if the last ones we'd sent hadn't uh, been sufficient, and I got a blank look. I mean, no offense, but Morgan's requisitioned enough to repair any operator in the station five times over now. We have other operators that need maintenance. Interesting. We need to recycle some stuff. Yeah. Uh, what's funny, no one knows what a reployer is. Not even the game devs. What? No, we're not going to climb the drawing. That would be rude. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is this? Oh, Neuromod, Neuromod, Neuromod. Ah, so we have four. Gunsmith. Use of weapon upgrade kits to upgrade security weapons beyond modification level one. Fix broken turrets. Using spare parts. I'd like to get that. Suit modification 2, upgrade the trans star uniform with extra. Inventory would be great. Inventory would be great, but I don't think that's 
whole lot of a problem right now. Hey, Seven, welcome. Thank you for joining. Uh, leverage, no, we don't need leverage. Well, I don't think we do. Firearms, increase damage. This would be good to have. 120%. Yeah, we're going to get this one. I'm not even going to think about it any further. <laughs> Give me this, please. Okay. Take that. Thank you. Nice little hobby station here. Thank you. You could customize a whole bunch of transformers here, too. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Take... We don't have the combination saved. If you forget the code. All right, hang on. Hang on, let's let's do a little bit of Googling here. Element? I'm guessing they're elements. ES element. Periodic table. 99. 99. And... The other one is... No, no, no. Come here. XE. No. XE element. 54? Yeah. 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 I'll, I'll take that. Anti-rads, but I like being rad. Psych, psy hypo. Nice. Recycler charge is perfect. Hobby station with a view of space. You don't get that every day. I mean, it's a lot better view than mine. That's for sure. <laughs> oh man, that would be awesome. Actually, actually, you have a lot of room. Like I would, I would use one of these bottom sections for like drawers. You know. So hypos are useful. Okay. All right. Wait, what is what is that for? I think those are stairs. Those are stairs. Those are stairs to where the phantom is. We don't want that just yet. Beyond the stars, an unofficial trans star history. Dubbed the Reyes Field Theory, this discovery proved to be the jumping off point for a string of scientific miracles Transtor began churning out less than a year later. Take, for example, the now ubiquitous operators, which take advantage of a localized lev levitation effect derived from the theory's gravitational outworkings. Indeed, from the matter stripping field, interactions inside the bowels of recyclers to the artificial gravity that keeps bo boots firmly planted on the Italian marble of the Talos One lobby. The impact of Dr. Reyes' theory is undeniable. These fucking... Okay, all right. All right. Don't know where he came from. Would it be too far to go back? Oh, the periodic table's right here. <laughs> I could have I looked at this thing and... I mean, it would have taken me a second. Uh, let's see. Where's 99 at? I don't even see 99. From 89 to 103? Oh, that's whack. And the other one's 54? Oh, that would have been tough to find on here. Map, 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 map. I'm glad Google helped. All right, cool. You know what? We're going to go back. Heal. Sorry I couldn't fix you, dude. Welcome. 
Maybe I can help you. Heal. Diagnosing. Superficial injuries. Nothing a portable medical kit can handle. This won't take long. Good as new. Thanks. You can fill out a service questionnaire as sure, a Sure, 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 sure. Yeah, yeah, later, later. Take what? I missed this? Why do I keep seeing stuff that I missed? Don't jump out at me. Don't jump out at me. Okay. Don't throw them out. Got it. Well, they're not considered junk, right? If they're not considered junk, I shall hang on to them. Where are you, dude? Where are you? Hello. Hey, hey. Your suit suffered some wear. Alright, now we have the Ark. Must watch out for the Ark of the Lightning. Unless there's a mimic for the video. Save it. Number six. Yes, overwrite. The Ark. I bet you seven saying Ark survival. What? <laughs> oh, he got me. Doctor, I need help. I need help, doctor. <laughs> Welcome. Maybe I, I can help you. Maybe I you can. Bruising, abrasions, fatigue. Nothing Try to relax. Good as there's new. Please fill out a pain experience okay. question. So there's multiple. So I can serve you better next time. Got it. Got it. I wonder if. Hmm. Um. Which way should we go? Let's try this way. the sights on any weapon it looks like that kind of sucks Is he actually coming up here? Is he actually... Is he actually walking towards the elevator? <laughs> I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Let me just get out of here. Alright. Yeah, we're, we're done with you. <laughs> he just very calmly started walking towards... <laughs> yes, please. Get me out of here. Uh... <clears throat> there is... Wish I could see... Which... Which... Yeah, I wish you could add, but oh well. Phantom can teleport, so I don't know why he's taking the elevator. I know, right? I guess he can't teleport from one floor to another. Otherwise, I'm sure he would have tried to have done that instead. Ooh, ads. Aim down sights. Oh, oh, okay. I don't know that. I'm not a gun guy. I'm not a gun guy. Oh, our buddy's still here. So why does this turret work? Why can this turret fire while it's 
half damage, but others can't. I'm curious about that. Scanning target, no type of material detected. This is malfunctioning. Oh shit! I forgot to use a recycler. Oh no. We can go back, can't we? You say it was two damage, but it looked like the health was about halfway as well, you know? You play Call of Duty, yes. With a bit yeah, but there was one like back where we got the uh, our suit healed up again. Let me just go there real quick. Because I don't know if I'm going to find other stuff that I want to pick up along the way. We're going to have that other phantom to take care of, though. He was on the second floor, though. <clears throat> if he's in the spot that he was still in before. There he is. I'm just gonna run over there. Wait. Wait, what? No! What the fuck? Hello, are you here for an appointment? Hurry up and heal me, dude. Shit! I was not expecting that. These these mother efforts just respawn, huh? Crap. Hey, dude. What the fuck? What the fuck, man? Mm -hmm. Critical. This is bad. No, this is bad. I shouldn't have come back here. System alert. The repair is needed. Please contact a qualified engineer. Can you repair me? Fuck. No. Oh, man, this is frustrating. I think I'm just going to reload. It's already like even um, more tougher enemies in the same spot here.
I'm looking for them. I don't even see them. I think I'm just going to reload. Hardware Labs? We're not gonna we're not gonna mess with that. Uh, this is back where we put the door back in here though, right? Yeah, let's get out of here. Uh yes. So every every time I go back into into um, a map, whether I've just been there. It's going to respawn enemies. And it's going to respawn different enemies. Like, all over the map. I should have expected that. Okay, we have our buddy. But I have, to ha I have to be careful here. Because things can just pop out from anywhere again. have to go through there. Mm -hmm. Got it. So let's put our, uh, our turret. Right in here. Eradicator auto turret version 0.7.6 online. Why was that door just open? Shit, something's in there. Something's in there. Deploying. Something's in here. And it had question marks. Take him out, dude. Oh, fuck! doesn't leave anything, huh? We have this. Oh, this is bullshit. This is bullshit, man. There were two of them. There were two of them. I can take this. Okay. I think our turret's done. See, this is what I'm talking about. Hmm. I don't know. Purple. Get to the purple and black one. You can split into two. I'm sorry, what? Get to that purple and black one? Talk about an item? can be split into what purple and black you have to be more specific purple and black what this one exotic
big bag candy. The phantom you just killed. This can be split in two. Oh, so it was a technically one phantom. Got it. Got it. I don't think I saw him split. I just saw the two. Well, that's great. That's fantastic. Copy that. There shouldn't be any new items here. I've already been through here. Yeah, this dude's done for. See, now it's less than, less than half health. Man, what if I just try to throw it? That's so weird. Uh, which is why you need the shotguns. Okay. All right. We're still going in the right direction. We're practically there, but there's probably going to be some more shit. Why are they all questioning? Oh, because they can split. Don't oh, fucking split, dude. Don't fucking split. straight now. That's the fabricator, right? Yep. Where was the, uh, here it is. Okay. Got it. Give me. Give me. Yeah, I should probably make some of those, right? Uh, Med kit. And bullets. Bullets would be nice. But that weapon's not, not the greatest. <clears throat> oh, anti the rats for the radiation. Huh. Doesn't take up that much. Uh, most I can make then is what? Uh, nine of them, which would be nice. I could only make one at a time, though, huh?
three of these. Let me make a few more. Shoot her really fast. Okay. Let us go to shotgun. Okay. I feel like I'm back to square one as far as uh, my armaments, my defenses, my offenses. Not a great feeling, man. Everything just kind of leveling up all at once. Kind of sucks. Oh, you know what? I need to get rid of these items here. Like these spare weapons. Yeah, I don't need them. Transfer that, transfer that. Two extra wrenches? Why? Why, dude? Why? Okay. Now that's looking much better. Mm -hmm. All of your organic material on the med kicks. Use the rest materials on bullets. For my, for the gun here. Oh, I do have shotgun shells already. Um, this takes what is it? Nine millimeter. Close the sight. Here it is. Thirty-one. Okay. Yeah, we'll make some more. Yikes. Three of those, but I have quite a few. Thirty. Nice. Shotgun shells. Um, fabrication plan. Okay. Stock up on a knife. Wait. You'll find a shotgun shell fabrication plan later in the game, so stuck up on the night. Okay. Thought I had more than that. Oh, it's only ten at a time. Ninety. No. Ah, uh, they're being split up. Ninety is a maximum. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. So I see the others over here now. Yeah, that's more than enough. Okay. 
a lot of bullets up here now. Okay. Um, up, 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 up. I mean, we have, um, what was it? Here we have six of them. Firepower 10. Uh, dismantle result 20. Okay. Unmodified 8. So it's going to give me two more firepower? Oh, I see. Now I would need gunsmith. So that's firepower 11. I think I'm going to leave it just at the firepower for right now. Yeah, I'll keep that other stuff the way it is. Okay. Uh, let me save here real quick. Whoops. Where's the marker at, though? Okay. Oh, it goes away. Got it. what I have to say next. You have to destroy Talos One. The research, the Typhon, nothing can survive. Sure. Including you. What? I know how what? it sounds, but you've seen what those creatures can do. They're a part of you now. If even one cell gets back to Earth, we're lost. What? I'm sorry. I wish there was another way. Oh, no. January can walk you through activating the self-destruct mechanism. Alex will try to stop you. He's allergic to failure too proud to go back to mom and dad with his tail between his legs so it's up to you now good luck told you you wouldn't like it no I don't like that I don't like that at all maybe we can fix ourselves yeah I'm sure there's a way oh what is this January Hello, Morgan. I'm January 2035. Hey. I'm an operator. There are many operators aboard Talos One, but none of them are like me. I can tell. No joke, I'm your plan B. My first task was to free you from the simulation. The second task was to make sure you saw your video. Those are done. Interesting. New directives are now available to me. The self-destruct protocol for Talos One is activated by two arming keys. Your brother has the first. You had the second. Alex destroyed your arming key. But you hit a fabrication plan for a new one in deep storage. That's where you need to go next. We can worry about getting Alex's key afterwards. The Typhon are spreading fast, Morgan. You'll be racing against them. And your brother. This key card will grant you access to the main lift and all the labs. The main lift is the fastest way to reach deep storage. Oh, so this is the dude that was talking to us. Like throughout the game, huh? Next topic. You asked me to provide you with more neuromods, which I've done. Good luck, Morgan. I have more autonomy than a typical operator. The contents of the video are sensitive. Only a flesh and blood person could handle the responsibility, I presume. <clears throat> Lobby to the Ar Arbor Arboretum. Arboretum. Hey, give me these bad boys. One. 
one near mod what am i gonna do with this huh nothing that's what to ease your natural suspicion. I'm sure you realize this. I mention it so that you'll know I'm earnest. You instructed me to sabotage the test procedures if Alex ever failed to release you, or if the Typhon organisms escaped containment. Both happened. Every neuromod takes a snapshot of your brain and models what it would look like if you learned something new. Then it makes those changes. Billions of connections remapped in a matter of minutes, all made possible by our friends from outer space. You've been trapped in the simulation for three weeks. Normally, the tests are only a few days long. Sounds good, Slayer. You're out, Dom? Alright, dude. Have a good night, bro. I'll catch you next time. Uh, find the one that increases your damage to security weapons? The skill. What? What? Hey, hey, I ain't done talking to you. Simmons installed blank neuromods on you. That's why you could remember the previous day's test and escape. And we're done talking. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. It's gonna take that much more near bonds to get the cool stuff. More valuable organs. Uh, got it. Leverage one. Oh, yeah, I see. attack 50% more damage. Oh, I would love that. I would love that so much. Okay. So we are headed to level 1, the main lift. Huh. Psychotronics, huh? Okay. Alright, so we're going to take the stairs back down to level one. Have a nice little walk in the lobby. Nice and chill. Nice and chill. All right, let's go. No milk. Sorry, dude. I'm out of milk, too. I'm out of milk. I'm out of creamer. I'm out of eggs. I need to head over to the uh, grocery store probably tomorrow. No one's going to get me, right? No one's going to get me here. Okay. Who's down there, huh? We good? Okay. I know there's a good... There should be a good turret down there, I think. Say before anything else. Yeah. Okay. Now we've been through here. Have we been through here? Oh, 
I don't think we've been in there. I don't think we've been in there. And there's probably some dudes in there. Redundant? Redundant? That's a big negativo. No, no, no. I don't think so. Okay. All right. All right. No funny business going on in here, right? What's tough is to try to determine if that sound is coming from this floor or somewhere else. Yeah, yeah, I'm not gonna forget. I'm not gonna go go blazing my bullets everywhere though. I'm still gonna be kind of frugal. Below, okay. How do you know? How do you know he's below? Slaya, Slaya, what the hell is that? What the hell is that, Slaya? <laughs> Uh, I don't need any water. I'll take the apple. <laughs> I give me this. That phantom was on fire too, like not in a good way. Oh, hello. Phantom's lit. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, I don't think I would be hearing that. That's probably the same one, too. Walking back and forth. Yeah. You're right. You're right. Tracking bracelet. Okay. Uh, let's check the emails real quick. Alejandro, who is the MSP being administered to? Inventory shows a case of the booster shots are missing. Regina Sellers. Regina, sorry, should have informed you. MSP uh, shot was for Chief Illusion. Mild uh, psychonomic fatigue. Should have logged it. My bad. Alejandro, please come see me. Can you transfer her charts and family records as well? Weird, I can't pull those records up. They're not in the system. Still want me to swing by? You're so useless, Alejandro. Incoming casualties. Attention all security officers in trauma. What? What now? The corpse vanishes. Get Bellini's room key from his body. Psychotronics. Oh, in psychotronics. Is that a an optional one? Or a side quest? Attention all security officers in trauma. You have multiple people en route with injuries, as well as a possible fatality. One of them is Dr. Sylvia Bellamy. Do not take him into the trauma center. He must be taken to psychotronics. This is an extremely grave security and health issue. I repeat, do not admit Dr. Sylvian Bellamy to the trauma center. Take him to psychotronics immediately. And then next day, oh, we took him to the uh, trauma center. Oh, we have to, wait, is this one of those things we have to find a crew member? I'll do that in a minute. Yeah, give me the map. Oh, I see. So the, 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 the parts of the map that were dark, we couldn't see anything before. Now we can. And we can still know where we've been to and where, where we haven't. I like that. I like that. So then what's... And we just have like a bit of a hallway. Haven't been here. Trying to get to over here. This big ass area. Life support psychotronics. Got it. Got it. Psychotronics foyer. Okay. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Um, wait, 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 wait. Objectives. <clears throat> oh, I don't have to find a, a name on the computer? Apparently, Bellamy's corpse is in the trauma center. 
and might still have a key card to his cabin. After some digging around, I found that Bellamy's corpse is actually looted, located in Psychotronics. Got it. Got it. Get Bellamy's room key from his body. Which is gonna be... Over here. Okay. Gonna be a fun experience for Bellamy. Got it. Right, let me back away from this now. Okay, and a test tube sample. I'll take that. Okay. Alright, time for some trauma. We have an operator dispenser here. Ooh. I would love to have access to that. There's another room to the uh, left of us. Maybe we can get in there first. Wait, something spotted us? Why is something spotting us? Why is something coming up over here? Oh shit. What's going on? No! No! Hopefully, oh man, that's just a regular phantom too. That's right, that's right, that's right, that's right. You're done. You're done, homie. You're done, homie. Just, just casually walked up to me, huh? How did he even see me? He had an appointment? <laughs> oh my god. He came up from like the bottom floor. That is some bullshit. I know it's not the one that we saw over here. What the fuck, man? Sheesh. Okay. It's not going to be fun. Shit. So there's like flames where he's walking around too, huh? That's that's awesome. Shit, man. Maybe if I turn this on. Switch. Switch. I 
think we're gonna leave this guy for later. Please contact a qualified engineer. What's this? Take that. What if I, what if I, hear me out, hear me out. If this doesn't explode on him while he's aflame, nothing will. I need him to be on this side. Where is he? Yeah, not, not over there, dude. Not over there. Kind of blocking the view there. System alert. Repair is needed. Please contact a qualified engineer. Dude, this had better work. Good afternoon, Talos. Don't forget that Transtar safety standards call for a weekly inspection of the What was that, man? Report to the hardware lab for a diagnostic. I'm pressing R2. I am pressing R2. That thing is whack. Yeah, I, I guess I guess I can use this, huh? Can I just load a previous save here? Um, let's do this one. Uh -huh. This is better. Still grab this, yeah. See, look, I'll even, I'll even show you. I'll even show you. R two, R two. That's it. That, that's, that's, that's what R two does. <laughs> ah. Well, all right. We're not gonna, we're not gonna get to that. Sadly, not quite yet. There's a room that's open, though. God, do I want to try and get there? Yes, I do. We're, we're risking it here now. Take that. Nobody jump at me, please. Nobody jump at me. Nobody jump at me. Start what? You're planning a vacation. Go somewhere familiar. You know you love or try something new. Oh, this is the test that I took in the beginning of the game. Right? No? Did I not choose right? Please wait. Maybe? Maybe with more... I know that with more leverage you can throw it farther. I still would, would have thought it would have blown up because of the on fire. What am I waiting for? program requirements document psychological risk studies show that there is a significant likelihood of behavioral conditions and psychiatric disorders emerging among the population of crew stationed for longer than three months impacts of behavioral issues are minimized with appropriate tools for monitoring mood and predicting risk 
while including as many Earth-like amenities and recreations as possible. Good cop, good cop. Extra from a book on interrogation techniques by Dr. Avalon Bayer. The typical interrogation sus suspect portrayed by entertainment media is stubborn, clever, or even arrogant, entering into a verbal sparring match with the interrogating officer. <clears throat> While this makes for, for good drama, it's a poor representation of actual cases. It is important to know that the majority of suspects want to talk. Let them provide some prompts but only to keep the words flowing. Do not attempt to direct them, but just keep them talking. My experience and case studies back this has been that most people will move for, toward the uh, information you want to know if you just listen to them and reaffirm their assumptions when they need it. I think there's some truth to that. I would believe that. Check out the emails here. Have my people been coming to you? Hey, Matt. Had another of my people uh, present a s present the signed note for you to for fatigue. I just want to make sure it's legit. Are there a lot of people coming to you with stress-related complaints, or is it my imagination? So then. Regarding Trevor Young, Matthias, I don't know what to tell you. He walked into an experiment without a psychoscope, and it went sideways. Hi! 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 Don't mind me, I'm just reading emails here. Okay, cool. Alright, let's, let's, let's keep reading here. Uh, we couldn't contain it after that. They controlled it. My suspicion is a typhoon. Good afternoon, Talos. Safety aboard Talos 1 is everyone's responsibility. Okay. Send all help requests or concerns to security at transstar.talos. My suspicion is the Typhon can force other beings to empathize with them. Maybe further down the road we can find a way to reverse engineer this, get them to empathize with us. Please keep Mr. Young in quarantine for the time being. You have my thanks. Hans Ketchup, Kelstrom. Anna, please keep staff away from the quarantine area. Oh, we have a key code. We have a potentially contagious subject in there who is suffering from memory loss. At this time, only Dr. Cole and myself should have access. Please set the new code to 5448 Hendrick DeVries. From the quarantine area. Quarantine area. Is that something I have access to right here? Trauma center. Oh, maybe it's here. Maybe it's the one that we're trying to get into in here. We'll give that another shot. Uh, utilities. Behavior test. Transtar quick behavioral uh, assessment for factory analysis. For correct drift assessment should be gathered uh, repeatedly by the same subject over time. Begin new test. New test started. Okay. I wonder if it's that quiz or the test on the other computer. The Phantom is still waiting for you? He can wait. He can wait. Just giving out tips. <laughs> Files. Session log, Dr. Calvino. Uh, my concern with Dr. Calvino is increasing. His symptoms have escalated from memory loss and occasional disorientation to delusions and paranoia. His increased agitation in the session has given me cause to take his issues up with Alex during our next briefing, debriefing session. Transfer that file over. I don't know if it's an audio file. Tell me about the dream. The dream. Yes. It's, um... It's always in my lab, uh, and um, I'm standing in front of uh, the glass. Are you alone? Uh, yes. What do you see in the glass? Uh, well, nothing. At first. I don't want to turn it on, but I can't help it. I have to turn it on. 
When I do, it's like the heart of a black hole, an immense darkness. There's something swimming in the black. I catch glimpses, edges of the shape. I feel as though it wants to come through onto my side. I have to turn off the glass before it sees me, but I always wake before I can. Turn what does it look glass? like? The shape in the glass. I, uh, nothing. Does it look like this image here? Dr. Calvino, does it look like this? No, 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 that, that's... No, I, I don't... Um... Are you sure? Uh, where did you get that drawing? Have you been spying on me? I don't want to talk to you anymore. Sarah Elazar, service hostilities toward me continue unabated. This distance she creates makes it difficult for me to address her issues of anxiety and distrust. Some of her answers today did lend me a bit of insight I might be able to use in future sessions to hopefully get her to open up more. Sarai, come in. It's Sarah. But you can call me Chief Elazar, Matt. Matthias, please. Forgive me, but your name is Sarai in the file. We've been over this. My mother Americanized it. Will we be spending the next 59 minutes like this? Because we could cut it short right now. We've discussed your mother. I thought perhaps today we could speak more about the career choices that were born of that. Serving in the military wasn't an excuse to get away from her nagging, Matt. I was just... restless. And you're better now? Not restless? I'm fine. Because your last tour of duty was the evacuation, and reports from there... I saved as many as I could. For every soldier we lost, we were able to save a hundred civilians. Yes. Tragic. Still, to lose soldiers under your command... The cost was worth it, both in lives and the unification of the region. Taking on a losing battle like that, fighting, not enemy troops, but the equivalent of a natural disaster. It wasn't natural, it was man-made. It prepared me for here, Dr. Cole. Because this station, it's the same thing, a disaster waiting to happen. We are well-trained and poorly equipped. <sighs> the research is dangerous. Keeping secrets secret is dangerous. I'm sure you would agree. This psychiatrist, I don't think is all that great. Doesn't seem all that great. I think that was a Desperado I just found. Thank you so much. Appreciate that. <laughs> yeah. One, one more here. Uh, Daniel Show. Daniel exhibits a relentless anger towards authority generally and the U.S. specifically. A few gentle questions sent her on a tirade that ended with her storming out of the office. I wouldn't be surprised if she decided to skip these meetings for the rest of her tenure here on Talos One. <laughs> yeah, he's kind of antagonizing him in a bit, you know, kind of like baiting him on. Doesn't seem all that great. These psych evals are a waste of time. A waste of time? Like back on Earth? That was different. Was it? Anger, issues with authority. A year of counseling doesn't sound like a trivial matter. Those files were supposed to be closed. Are you angry? I'm getting there. Any new relationships? No. I thought you and Miss Foy, the sanitation engineer, were seen together. She's a sanitation boss, and we're not in a relationship. Not anymore. Ah. And this separation, did it involve anger? Issues with authority? Screw this! I'm done! Report me to the U's, I don't care. They're putting the station at risk just like Transtar North and just like on Earthside. You assholes will bury it with your psych eval bullshit. And another thing. Well. Uh. I think that's it, right? Yeah, I think that's it. that nothing here uh, uh oh
Wait. 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 Why is he able to, uh... No. No. What the F, dude? Somewhere near. Oh, wait. Are there correct answers? Oh. No, I don't think so. Get in here now? We still don't have it. No, that's not it. Okay. Uh, time to save. ACBAC? Hmm, okay. I'll give it a shot. I'll go back in here. Oh! afternoon, Talos. In the event of a loss of atmosphere, gravity, or other serious emergency, please report to the nearest muster station. Well, I got a resort over here. Utilities. Test started. Test started. Here we go. Alright. Here we go. ACBAC. You can go like all the way under the desk, huh? In front of the computer. Oh, right here. Oh, oh. This was. Oh, it moved the. Uh, it moved the. The painting, right? Here we go. You seem. Thanks, dude. Frustrated. I have months that are just. Gone. Oh, it's I've ours. Been listening to the logs, reading the research, playing catch up. Do you know how many times we've had this conversation? This is the fifth time. 
does it always go the same way? Not always. What does that mean? What do you think it means? Well, I think it means you should be concerned as my counselor. You left yourself a message. Would you like to listen to it? No. I think it what the fuck? I said no. What the fuck me. is this thing Why doing? Do no. I don't know. I, I, I just know. You agreed to this. This was all your idea. <laughs> Yours and Alex's. I didn't agree to any of this. All right, that Morgan is not Excuse me. Excuse me. Do you know what's going on in psychotronics? Do you? If I did, I can't even I hear this. Say, you know that. What do you know about the Typhon? <laughs> We shouldn't talk about them. Not without your brother present. I'm not getting any of this. You do know, you snake. <laughs> okay. How can you sit there? Morgan, Ooh. take a deep breath. Here. I don't want a pill. I want this station shut down. I want Earth. Morgan. I said no! <sighs> okay. I'm going to call Alex. This game is weird, dude. It almost, it almost made it seem like the Phantom was listening to the recording and found us that way, but then I just kind of like ran right by him? I mean, okay. I got, I got the gist of the recording though. <laughs> that was so funny though, oh my god. We should probably save. <laughs> look, look. Some people have skills though, huh? Some people can just do it. Ah! <laughs> To the back cave. Woo! All right, here we go. I know there's at least one phantom here. What's over here? Have I been in here? I have not. And, oh, there's another security station. Okay. Dr. Calvin? I don't know. Um, the doctor's body... That was, I don't think we encountered the doctor's body in the trauma center. I don't think. I don't think. Oh, we have some stairs. But it's still level one. Okay. Whoa, 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 buddy. Not going in here. Okay. Okay. That's the exhibit. Yeah, the main lift is right at the center there. The name Phantom? What happened to it? Well, the one that's a that's a that's a flame is obviously still there. Wait, what? What was that? Banana. Okay. There's a turret around here. intact fully intact oh shit oh shit all right we're gonna do something different here come on that's right. Shoot them from high up? Like headshots? That was another phantom up here. The pistol doesn't seem to do much, though. We 
we've been we've been here. Okay. All right. Well, we got to save again. I mean, these are regular phantoms, though, so... Um, should it be that tricky to take them out, but still. I'd like to use um, as less ammunition, as little ammunition as possible. Why are you walking so fast, dude? You know what, though? Ooh, nice. Nice, 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 nice. Now we'll get you up over here. Yep, keep, keep on. Oh, fuck! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hang on a second! Wait, 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 wait. I think we're gonna try this again. A recycler? A recycler? Did he really? No, dude, we didn't really get to use the uh, the turret that well. No, 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 no. Try that again. Yeah, let's try that again. He got the jump on us. Oh, because I don't want to waste them. I don't want to use a whole lot of them. Just plus, just for one enemy. I'd rather utilize a turret for that, if I may. I know, Slayer. I, I know. I know. I'm trying to not use it. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> okay. What? I'm going to put this down. Scan over here, dude. Scan over here. 2030. Top 2025. The Transdarb Night. What? No! <laughs> Damn. That is. See, look at that bullshit, man! God damn it. Alright. Damn. Well, you took out some hits. Thanks. Appreciate you. Kite them with the foam, foam darts. Uh, together, then bomb them. Uh, that's probably possible. They move so erratically, though. And then they, like, warp right in front of you. There's still another one, I know. Um, towards the, uh, towards the lift. We'll get to that one in a second, though. Could always make more ammo. Yep, 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 I can, yep, I can. Although I don't have infinite supplies for their spare parts, so... I'm trying to be mindful of that. Take that, thank you. No, no, no. But see, this does not run out of ammo. 1963, a top secret. I don't want to hear this. Oh God! Survivor's account of the evacuation day one. I had dropped off my dog at the groomer. Her name was Aliza. It means joy. I said goodbye and walked a few blocks to get some uh, coffee bots near the park. 
Some jets flew over very low, and the sound was so loud it made me jump. I don't know where they were from, but they were bristling with bombs and rockets. Everyone was looking up, and the sound of the jets was echoing off the buildings, but they could not see them anymore. The sky was clear, and I could see pink smoke rising from the direction of the stadium. Then the sirens started. I had not heard them since my childhood. Some people stood confused, but my instinct told me to run. Run away from the stadium. Run away from Aliza. Some people were running with me, but we didn't know where to go. I saw a policeman directing people into a basement restaurant. I think it was an old bomb shelter. I looked up at the sky again and saw an airliner. It was not military, I'm certain. I think it was going to the airport. While I watched, it turned into glitter without a sound. It was just gone. A man near me began to curse. I fell down and hit my head on the street. Yikes. That's not a good time. What the hell is that sound? What the hell is that sound? Twenty thirty, twenty twenty five, nineteen eighty, nineteen nineteen sixty three. A top secret Cold War negotiation culminates with Americans and Soviets Fire. working together on a research facility named Kletka. Kletka, Russian for cage, produces the skeleton and core emergency systems of what will one day become Talos One. Good afternoon, Talos. Join us in congratulating no, Dr. Lorenzo no, Calvino. Nineteen sixty four. After the attempted assassination of Kennedy and Khrushchev's departure, the U.S. pays for the rights to use Kletka as a testing facility. This period, known as Project Axiom, leads to many advancements in next-generation materials and bioscience fundamental to neural modification. 1980 to 1994. Geopolitical developments result in a temporary hold on Project Axiom. After the unfortunate Pobeg incident, in which two research scientists lose their lives, the Kletka facility is decommissioned and cleaned. Wow. 2025. The Transtar Board of Directors is established. Transtar purchases and privatizes the Kletka facility with a focus on safety and state-of-the-art upgrades. 2030. Talos One becomes fully operational, representing a monument of private space industry. The first Neuromod is released, allowing for dramatic enhancement to the human mind and body. Time out for ads. Are we getting are we getting ads here? Uh, oh. Hello. Whoa, 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 what the hell? What? Perfect time. We have five neuromods. Oh man. Oh boy, are we gonna do it? Are we gonna do it? We did it. We did it. Hey, buddy. I need three. Okay. I can't fortify it, though. That's okay. Yes. I wonder how far its range is. Deploying. What the fuck? No! No! <laughs> no! No! <laughs> oh my god! No! Not my buddy! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god uh we're in trouble <laughs> god damn
And I didn't save it right before that, too. Well? Well? <laughs> they said, oh, no, you don't. Wait, was it already split up? So there isn't another one. Huh. Okay, yeah. Oh. Did the turret do any damage on them? Damn, they sent them flying. Hey. Welcome back, dude. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you firing at? Hey, relax, relax, you're okay. Oh my god, he's traumatized. I'll just put you right back here again. There we go. There you go. Okay. Oh, I forgot to check this. Okay. All right, we're, we're doing okay. We could use one of those um, uh, little robots to help heal us. Were there any? We have a recycler. Um, security station. Operator dispenser over here. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. But that's where the trauma center. Oh, what if we, what if we try to go back there with our little buddy? We got a job for you, dude. Uh, before anything, let's let's save. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's take a little troll here. A little stroll, rather. And I'm gonna place you. I think I'm gonna place you over here. Actually, yes, right there. Take him out, dude. Ah, shit. Too far? You can't see him from here. Okay. Run away. Run away. Run away. I got you. Whoa, 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 whoa. Final signs critical. <laughs> okay, hang on, hang on, hang on. Where are they at? Right here. No, that's not it. This. And I'll do a couple of these. Okay, go. Pop, pop star. Yeah, give me some pop star. Did any damage right there? Hmm. It's weird how it just starts firing when it's lopsided like that. Oh, it did do some damage. Okay. Put you right over here, dude. Something. Yeah, but they're doing damage there. Look at that. I got a 
fix my suit, too. We're going to have an operator dispensed right here. Hopefully, it's a suit operator. What is it called? Engineer operator? Because that's what we need fixed. I wouldn't mind having regular health, though. Auditory version 0.7.6 online. Uh-huh. Yep. What if I the other side here? Up, 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 up. Come on. Come on, come on. Here he comes. Here he comes. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna shoot at him as well. Come on. Hell yeah. Back on the, ah, there's the lure. We're gonna save now. <sighs> okay. We got this again. Petri dish sample. Psy hyper. Let's go back to my trusty wrench. Yeah, it doesn't seem like it's that expensive to re repair the turrets. Not a lot of spare parts to do so, so that's good. Um, this way. Whoa, 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 let, let's, let's wait, let's wait, let's wait. Lucia Jimenez. And that's it? That's all that's in here? Nothing with that, okay. Nope, we actually don't need that. System alert. Repair is needed. Please contact a qualified engineer. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wait. Medkit fabrication plan? I thought we already had that. Are there repeats? What? White noise. Exit from white noise. Perceptions. Oh, and perceptions. Burned in Regal. More often called white noise due to the telltale spots said to be like static in the victim's eye. White noise isn't just a medical condition. And it's more than the than the wild, almost witch doctor-like claims of psychic ability. Dr. Deo Igui, anyway? It's disenfranchisement. It says the victim can never have a neuromod, nor can their brain be mapped. It's the end of everything that is about a person. Who does Transstar to decide? We lent them at a biological caste system to the human race. We don't have a password. Shit. Can't hack it. Patient tested positive for non-small cell lung cancer. Patient did not list any ailments on their submission form prior to begin 
to being taken to scale recorder. Contact this patient immediately. If patient is still on Talos 1, have them report to the trauma center as soon as possible. Expired plasma bag. Good afternoon, Talos. Don't forget that Transstar safety standards call for a weekly inspection of your uniform. Report to the hardware labs for a diagnostic. the station i'm going to wait up on that for a little bit multiple to the same for what purpose for any is there any purpose to doing so seems kind of a waste up 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 yo come to papa we have two of them Focus stealth. Just so you don't miss out on. Okay. Can I recycle them? Would be useful if I could. Enter state of combat focus for 10 seconds. It slows time around you. I have a question, Slay. I don't mind if you tell me this. Combat focus one. Is this a, an ability that I have to activate before entry battle, or does it activate on its own? I'd like to know before. It does suck that the game doesn't tell you that. Increased damage of security weapons. Oh, yeah, by pressing L2. Okay. I don't think I can have that right now. Firearms. Six? Oof, gonna take me a while. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna save this. Yeah, I'm gonna save these points. Whoop, 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 excuse me. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Probably use some more inventory at this point. Man. Quarantine. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. This is important. Yeah. Okay. At this point, then let me um, let me activate the little robot here. Operator dispenser. Ah, yes. Requesting new operator. Ah, I don't need this one. Though. But it makes sense to have this one in the trauma center. I Trans guess. Star oh. Pyramid Maybe I can help you. Zero medical class operator ready to yeah. deploy. Please stand clear of aperture. Diagnosing. No trauma or illnesses detected. I'm afraid there's nothing I can do for you. Unless okay. you're interested in medical trivia. Or a joke. Nope. Thank you. Wait. What was this? I missed this. What's in here? What's in here? Don't jump out at me. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Gonna drink out of the sink. Yeah, me too. I did.
Plus it's in the subtitles too. Trevor J. Young. Subject appears disoriented, paranoid. Not sure how much of current behavior is due to the incident versus his recent Miramon removals. Recommend continuing observation. Remain two meters away from glass. Oh, no. Dr. Trevor Young, mind control. What does that say? Rise? 24? Oh, that's a code. I bet that's a code for something. Yes. We should probably use one of those. Um, 30. What, what was this? save here. Here we go. Okay, I think we're going to leave him in there. Yeah, let's just go. Can we break this? Of course not. Yeah, yeah, I think I'm going to do that. I think I'm good. I'm good. Did we... Uh... There was that one other room. We don't have a code for this one. No key card. <sighs> you know what, though? Hang on a second. You follow me. I want you to meet somebody. Zero point seven point six. You're not even one point oh model. What the hell? Proximity sensor reset. Okay. Pretty sure we're going to need that. Checking for updates. Servers offline. He's got nothing on him. Well, that's upsetting. He didn't want to talk. Hello. Good to see you again, Dr. Yu. Oh, that's a robot talking. Okay. That's it for this place, then. Okay. I'm glad we came back here. Back to level one. Um... We have human resources. I don't know if we have access to that area yet. Let's go find out. 
go take a look. System alert. Repair is needed. Please contact a qualified engineer. Oh, wait. We didn't go in here. Stay right here. Chris Wade. Oh, no. Wade, please, 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 with a cherry on top, fix the medical operator that's been sitting on your desk. Come on, Wade. System alert. Repair is needed. Please contact a qualified engineer. That thing's gonna... That thing's gonna kill me, huh? Tom Kenny. <laughs> Animated Starscream. Oh, the voice? The voice doing this? Is that... Oh. Spongebob, right? Spongebob. No. Well, I already have one. System alert. No, Repair is needed. No. Please contact a qualified engineer. Sorry, dude. Who puts a lemon peel in the microwave? This is not working. No power. Okay. All right. Wait, wait. Why does the thing have a green light on it? Okay, all right. System alert. Repair is needed. Please Emergency contact TP? a qualified engineer. Always, always. All right, we're good, dude. I thought there was like a, a way to go across here. I mean, I can, but I won't be able to carry uh, our friend. You know what? Maybe I can. Maybe I can. Actually, I met Tom Kenny back in later 2022. He was excited to talk about animated because surprisingly no one talks to him about it or uh, brings some TFA stuff to sign. I got on the sign my complete series of TFA DVD cover. Oh, that's awesome, dude. Oh, that's fantastic. Was this at a convention? I'm guessing. I've never met him. I've never met him. I hope he still does conventions. I wouldn't mind meeting him. He did a really good star scream. He did like a really good star scream. Like I think one of the more the one of the most like. Um, classic versions of Starscream that um, I think anybody's in it ever really done. Who did uh, Starscream in um, in Transformers Prime? It was definitely a different take, but it was also inspired by uh, G1. Can we do this? Oh, do we totally can? We totally can. Now we have to go across over here. There we go. Someone's Good coming afternoon, up. Carlos. Someone's Security coming reminder. up. Sticky notes, even well hidden ones, are not a secure means of storing your workstation that password. That was a bust. That was a total bust, the Rooney. Steve Blum. Damn, where did it come from? Just appeared out of nowhere. Phenomenal. Oh, yeah, dude. Dude, they're just looking around, man. Nothing is getting past them. Hey, Jasimus, what's up, dude? Welcome. He deserves a reprise Starscream. Easily one of the, my favorites. Steve Blum did Starscream TFP as well. As wait, is it like let me know? RID 15, even Earth Spark. Okay, look, he's gone. Let me go back now. Okay, okay, 
heard, I heard, I heard. Yeah, I don't know he did Starscream and Earthspark. That's news to me. Wheeljack and the Bumblebee movie, really? Oh, the one line, right? There's too many of them. Is that it? There's too many of them. I think that's the line, right? <laughs> Shamey was replaced when they uh, redesigned Wheeljack with Pablo. Yeah, but you know what? It still wouldn't have been the Wheeljack that we like from the Bumblebee movie, you know? They obviously had a much different plan for that Wheeljack and um, Prize of the Beasts. How's everyone been? <laughs> oh, 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 Seven's still here. Hi, Seven. <laughs> We're doing pretty good, Jasmus. Having a great time in Prey. Fantastic. Fantastic. POV, I see Starstream getting, getting karma. <laughs> oh, man. The... Uh, they really spotted us. From wherever the hell it was that they were at, I still want to get to this area if I can. I don't. I, I probably, probably don't have access to it just yet, though. But I still want to get over there. All right. Man, I just, I just took um, our little turret there to die, huh? Let's try it again. Good afternoon, Talos. Security reminder. Sticky notes, even well-hidden ones, are not a secure means of storing your workstation password. One shall stand, one shall fall. Yeah. Yeah! I can probably jump down from here and be okay. <laughs> Not sticky notes. All right, let's, let's take the safe route. Okay, so there's a phantom over there. Somewhere around here. No? Okay. What the? Over here, dude. Good afternoon, Talos. Lunch is served in the cafeteria from 12 to 2 p.m. Why isn't Please the turret? to the weekly upgrade for today's menu. What happened to the turret? Are you sleeping on the job? What? Oh, dude. We're going to have to have a talk after that, man. Uh, Eradicator auto turret version 0.7.6. Yeah, he just, he just like went like to sleep mode right there. Got to use him for killing a what now? Come on now. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Been a while, yeah. Random question, what's your favorite uh, sound with design? I mean, other than G1? You know I like the classics. You know I like the classics. But other than that, I don't know. Transformers Prime. Transformers Prime. Oh, that's the one where he was like that spy plane with the really long arms, huh? The, uh... The, the actual, like, um, screen for, like, the face. That one was really unique. I, I did enjoy that one. Ooh. Wait, we've already been in there. Wait. Wait. That's for... This room. We're going to go back. We're going to go back. Yeah. It was just sitting here. I'll take you. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave him there. 
I'm going to run my ass over there. Back to the trauma center. Yeah, we've already been there. But there was that one room we couldn't get in. Which I'm guessing we can now. Right? No? Was that just to get into the trauma center then? We didn't hack this, did we? No, I'm tripping then. I'm tripping. The sound wave is a, is a really good fit. Yeah. Yeah. I like how he's totally mute um, in Prime, isn't he? Like, he has like sound clips or, or whatnot. Oh, okay. Okay. So that was kind of redundant. Okay. Got it. I got a little bit excited. Sorry. I'm pretty sure there's nothing really around here. That's where we're going to go, the lift. We're not going to do that just yet. We're still exploring. Lots and lots of exploring to do. Can we pick these? Nope. Okay. Uh, oh, we can pick these. Thank you. Thank you. What's that sound? I don't want sounds. There was a phantom around. I think he's on the second floor. Most iconic lines. Decepticon superior, Autobots inferior. Debug build version 0 0.7. Well, kind of. Isn't the actual line Soundwave superior, Constructicons inferior? I think that's one of the more memorable ones. Uh, let me save. I feel, I feel like I haven't saved in 10 minutes. Uh, none from Transformers Prime, not, not, not G1. Oh, so did he actually speak in Prime? I thought it was mute. I've already been in there, right? Some of it, not the Subicons. Yeah, that's the restrooms. We've definitely been there. We have a recycler back here. Uh, we haven't been into the Psychotronics foyer. We should probably use a recycler. First, let me check to see if there's any... Hang over here. Wait. Wait, where am I heading into? This is the actual restroom, though. Oh, yeah, we can get over here. There's none over here, right? Employee orientation. We've been in there. We've been in there, yep. Oh, that's right. That's right, we can't get in here. Yeah, got it. Maybe from the foyer. We'd have to go all the way around for that. Was there a phantom in that area? Let's go find out. Let's go find out. Come here, dude. I think there was, and that's why I didn't go in there. Or maybe because it's locked. Oh, we can unlock it. Yes, in that case, I'm going to put you closer. Go, save it again. Yes. Okay. This is fun. Like, I feel like we're starting to open up these areas here. Do it. Uh huh. Mmm. Butter chicken. Mmm. Nice. Nice. Enjoy it, dude. Wait, this is Psychotronics? I thought this is just a foyer for Psychotronics. It's the foyer for Psychotronics. Scanning target, no alien material detected. Good. Uh, what? I'll leave you alone for right now. What? Oh, wait. 
this? Notes. Elias, you left your character sheet on the printer. Don't forget we moved the game to the rec room and crew facilities, and it's an hour later than usual. Do us a favor and take a happy pill before showing up. See you later, you grumpy grouch. Now, Yuri. Turns out Yuri uh, Kimura's like everyone else. I'll tell you over lunch. Aw, oh, dang it. Well, <laughs> okay. Uh, we don't have the uh, unlock code. Instead of a chill pill, it's a happy pill, right? Yeah. Maybe they're a Debbie Downer or something. <laughs> uh, Psychotronis isn't uh, really dangerous. It's just uh, really spoopy. This is beyond us. Staff only. Okay. Hey, dude. I got you, dude. Oh, no. I can't. I can't repair him because he's not fully destroyed yet. Yeah, we cheesed it. <laughs> All right. I love you some cheese. He said, surprise, mother. Oh, wait. <laughs> What's this? <laughs> um... Reload this. All right. You are entering a maximum security area. Hey, what happened to this? Why is it dark? I think I hit the button too quick. Uh, okay. I still want to get to that room to get to the recycler, which I think is this one. Hello, Morgan. This time we spoke. My code name is December. My purpose to help you escape Talos 1. I know your memory's shot full of holes, but you left instructions that the Typhon should break containment. Alex has a private escape pod. You made a copy of his launch key and hid it in the Neuromod division, along with a supply cache. I'll transmit the location to your map. I'll contact you again when you've got the key. Oh, so now there's December. Okay. No type of material. Oh no, not this. Shit. Um, I think I'm able to block it with some glue, but only for a little bit, right? Attitude adjustment required. Yeah, I know, right? We skipped a whole lot of months there. I need to save again. I don't know what the difference between regular save and quick save, quick saving is. I think quick saving is gonna automatically be like in one quick save slot. I hear you. Dude, those arcs go really far. I see it. Okay, so this is malfunctioned. I don't think we have the know-how to fix it. Just yet. And I can't clear this. Repair it? Yeah, we can. Hell yeah. There we go. Nice. Start. I got it. I got it. Hell yeah. We're good. 
We're golden, baby! Alright, cool. Just so it's a previous autosave, which is every five minutes. Every five minutes? I thought whenever we like opened a new door or went somewhere somewhere new, every five minutes is cool. That's actually pretty handy. I still like making my manual saves though. Um I think that's pretty much it for here. Make sure and double check. Yeah, I think that's it. Okay, we're good. Glad nothing jumped out at me right there. Okay. Looking good, feeling good. Probably not a good sign. You're any psychotron. Oh shit. That's wait. Okay, I see. Did you already know about the main lift? It's malfunctioning. I'm not sure why, but the car is stuck at the top. There's another route through the psychotronics lab. Morgan, that lab is where the Typhon broke containment. Oh. Please be careful. So I think I was supposed to try to use the main lift while I was in the lobby and find out that it was malfunctioning. I didn't do that because I wanted to uh, explore everything first. Get to a safe area. Check your surroundings, walls, floors, ceiling. Then seal yourself in. We're working on the problem and we'll be there to retrieve you as soon as we can. Elazar out. Oh shit. Oh yeah, this leads down, huh? Um, well, oh yeah, so we, we don't have to get to the main lift anymore. Interesting how the voice, how the script, um, I, I, I have to imagine it's differentiating what it says if you tried the main lift or not, because he said, did you know about the main lift? It's malfunctioned. So there's no point in even going back and trying it now. We have... We have our next destination. Um, what is that marker for level two? All the way on the right. Is there something else here, maybe? Oh, Neuromod Division. Maybe a side quest? Yeah. Where's December? Yeah, that's what that is. Okay. And the main story has this marker. Okay. Well, now that I know that I'm this is heading towards the main story, I kind of don't want to do this just yet now. Hmm. Kind of want to go back. And um, still try for the human resources area. See if that's available to us. Neuromod Division has a side marker with it. Get the key to access Alex's escape pod, Neuromod Division. Okay. How many Neuromods do we have? Just two. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna head back. We're not gonna do this just yet. Let's go, buddy. any assumptions here yeah there's no even way to access it now something spotted me something spotted me deploying Yeah, yeah, but nah. <laughs> I'll get to the story. What? What? Activate. 
adjustment required. Scanning target. No type and material detected. Something just... Something moved over here. Uh, this game's just messing with me, huh? Okay. I wish I could fix this right now. Just like one hit from a phantom is going to be all it takes to take it out. Come on, dude. Where are you? Heading up. IT security. I did not go in there last time because of the phantom. You know what? Fuck. Let me bring you up here. Smoke is 15 frames per second. <laughs> it's all like a muster. Knock, knock. What? <coughs> this is blocked. Something spotted me. Shit, man. <coughs> oh, I need to get some water. Oh, hang on. Be right back. Sorry, AG. I'm just seeing your message. I will catch you in the next one, dude. Thanks for joining, man. <clears throat> okay. All right. Here we go. Something keeps spotting me around here, though. Maintenance access. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. that's a hallway that leads to a dead end. Interesting. Maybe it's, um, they can give me access to the IT security. 11,000. Interesting. What's over here? Sales division. Uh, looks like I've been in there, though. to go back in there, right? No. Ah, yes. I can scope them out from up here.
got me, dude. You got me. Definitely a dead end there. Trons what? Hybrid power generator. behind the uh, the office right huh interesting okay monthly Megatron did he just put it in the video may not be monthly I know <laughs> he's been doing that for a few months now I think What is the point of accessing this then, I wonder? Oh shit, there's two of them. Vapor? Vapor reviews? Yeah. find out what happens if they do spot me from up here well that's a thing I can do Shit, don't fall down. Don't fall down. That is good. That is really good. I 
now, we'll just take a stroll down here. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Pick up the pieces, baby. Yeah, that was that was a good use of this um, recycler charge, I think. Let me get my little buddy here. Don't shoot. Don't shoot. I'm a friendly. <laughs> Hell yeah. Okay. <coughs> um. something useful to do with the computers here you would imagine there's one room behind a door that's the exit the owl hello nice Hell yeah. James Bradley, Joan Stewart, James Bogart film. Hell yeah. Chipsets. I'm pressing it. I'm pressing it. Oh! Heavy Gear Optimizer, CRU. Increased movement and aiming speed while firing the glue, cannon, or Q-beam. Oh, what's a Q-beam? Don't tell me. Don't tell me. I don't want to know. <laughs> uh, let's see. Hell yeah, baby. Perfect. Is it faster? I think it is, huh? Okay. Human bodies? What? But how do you how do you place them into the dispenser? You gotta cut them up. Shit, we don't have access to this yet. Okay. And this is the exit. Which we've been to already. Okay. Uh, let's see. We couldn't get to human human resources. That was kind of blocked off to us. I still wonder what other phantom was spotting us from before. Level three. We've already, we've already done that. We've been in there. Okay. Come on, dude. Let's go. Grenade. That's morbid. Next up, it's going to be down into Cyclotronics? Yeah. Okay. Which we shall do next time. Overwrite that. Hey. That was cool. That was good. 
Um, still having a good time with it. Still enjoying it. I don't. I, don't, I think the most upsetting part though is the setback when we went back to that previous map that we had just gotten cleared up, and then all of the enemies were there and a lot of um, tougher ones. So we have to watch out for that. But we're gonna continue with Psychotronics uh, next week. Next week. Thanks for being here, Slay Up. Thank you, everybody else, for joining me. I'd appreciate it. Um, if you're watching on YouTube, feel free to hit that like and subscribe. We appreciate that very much. Follow me on the social medias. Links are down below. And I will catch you all on the next one, okay? Have a good night. Adios.